Good Thursday evening, everybody. I'm Storm Track Meteorologist Nate Harrington. A busy day today preparing for some severe weather that didn't come to pass. We had a line of showers and some thunderstorms that moved through 10, 11 to noon through central Alabama, and that just took the instability away from the atmosphere. But right now, we are watching a line of showers from Walker County down through Tuscaloosa County and into the southwest corner of our viewing area. No thunder with any of this right now. But it bears watching because it's going to be entering into some more unstable air in the eastern and southeastern corner of our viewing area. So that could cause these storms to pop. I just don't think that's going to necessarily happen. The National Weather Service here in Birmingham thinks there is a chance. The Storm Prediction Center thinks that our severe weather threat is now done. So a couple of different schools of thought. I personally don't think there's going to be too much to be seen with this line. But of course, we're going to watch it over the next couple of hours. And it should be out of our hair by 8 to 9 o'clock. All right, so let's talk about the future cast. The future cast actually has a pretty good handle on where the rain is right now. I think it's just overdoing the strength just a little bit, and that will lead to some inconsistencies uh, on the future cast. So there you see it moving through East Alabama by 8 to 9 o'clock and then out of the area basically by 10 to 11. Uh, and then just cloudy until we get to tomorrow morning where clouds will start to clear out. And we're going to see a pretty nice Friday forecast shape up. A little bit of sunshine, a little bit of cloud cover mixed in. But not a bad day at all. Comfortably cool. More clear sky through Friday night into Saturday. And uh, Saturday afternoon looks like more sunshine too for us and warmer. But we've got to talk about more chances of strong and maybe even severe weather. Yeah, on Sunday for Easter, that is the worst possible time to talk about severe weather. But it might happen on Monday morning. The showers linger. Tuesday into Wednesday looking like nice spring days. But once again, more thunderstorm chances on Thursday. So we're going to have to keep our eyes peeled with this. And download the Storm Track Weather app. It's free in the App Store or Google Play right now. Any forecast updates, live interactive radar, weather alerts on your phone at your fingertips at all times. We'll have another update coming up tonight on the CBS 42 News at 11 o'clock. We're getting pushed back because of basketball. We'll see you then, guys.